Welcome to our Advent Meditative Compline for Thursday, December 8th, 2022. As the day comes to a close and we complete the day with the Compline, also known as the Bedtime Prayer of the Church, let us relax into a comfortable position starting with a moment of silence. Be still, aware of God's presence within and around you. Our call to prayer. O oh God, come to our assistance. O oh Lord, hasten to help us. The Holy One grant us a restful night and peace at the last. Amen. Our opening Advent night hymn, Creator of the Stars of Night. Creator of the Stars of Night. Your people's everlasting light, O Christ, Redeemer of us all. We pray you hear us when we call. When this old world drew on toward night, you came but not in splendor bright, not as a monarch but the child. Of Mary, blameless mother mine. Come in your holy might, we pray. Redeem us for eternal day. Now come, O Savior, to set free your own inglorious liberty. At your great name, O oh Jesus, now All knees must bend, all hearts must bow All things on earth with one accord Like those in heaven shall call you Lord Our Confession and Assurance O most holy and beloved, our companion our guide upon the way, our bright evening star. We repent the wrongs we have done. We have wounded your love. O oh God, heal us. We stumble in the darkness. Light of the world, transfigure us. We forget that we are your home. Spirit of God, dwell in us. Eternal Spirit, living God, in whom we live and move and have our being, all that we are, have been, and shall be, is known to you, to the very secrets of our hearts, and all that rises to trouble us. Living flame, burn into us. Cleansing wind, blow through us. Fountain of water, well up within us, that we may love and praise in deed and in truth. We are a forgiven people. Thanks be to God. Our help is in the name of the Lord, who made heaven and earth. Psalm 134 Behold now, bless God, all you servants of God, you that stand by night in the house of God. Lift up your hands in the holy place and bless God. 
God who made heaven and earth bless you from Zion. Glory to you, O Trinity, most holy and blessed. One God, now and forever. Amen. Our scripture reading comes from Jeremiah, chapter 29, verse 11. For I know the plans I have for you, plans for welfare and not calamity, to give you a future and a hope. Holy wisdom, holy word. Thanks be to God. Gracious God and loving Savior, thank you for the peace that passes all understanding that you so freely provide. Let us cling to your promises and live in the hope you grant us. Amen. Eternal Spirit, life giver, pain bearer, love maker, source of all that is and that shall be, mother and father of us all, loving God in whom is heaven, the hallowing of your name echo through the universe. The way of your justice be followed by the peoples of the world. Your heavenly will be done by all created beings. Your commonwealth of peace and freedom sustain our hope and come on earth. With the bread we need for today, feed us. In the hurts we absorb from one another, forgive us. In times of temptation and test, strengthen us. From trials too great to endure, spare us. From the grip of all that is evil, free us. For you reign in the glory of the power that is love, now and forever. Amen. Our night hymn, God who made the earth and heaven. God who made the earth and heaven, darkness and light, who the day for toil has given for rest the night. May thy angel guards defend us, slumber sweet thy mercy send us, holy dreams and hopes attend us this live long night. When the constant sun returning unseals our eyes, may we born anew like morning to labor rise. Gird us for the test that calls us, let not ease and self enthrall us, strong through thee whatever befall us, O God most wise. In peace we will lie down and sleep. In the Lord alone we safely rest. Guide us waking, O Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. May the divine help remain with us always, and with those who are absent from us. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit, for you have redeemed me, O Lord, O God of truth. Canticle of Simeon Lord, you have set your servant free to go in peace as you have promised. For these eyes of mine have seen the Savior, whom you have prepared for all the world to see. A light to enlighten the nations, and the glory of your people, Israel. Glory to you, O Trinity, most holy and blessed, one God, now 
and forever. Amen. My brothers and sisters in Christ, may the Holy and Blessed Trinity guard and bless us this Advent season and beyond. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. Thank mm-hmm. you.